why would you want to use multiple solar charge controllers? Yeah, you, I can think of two reasons right off the bat. Maybe I'll come up with the third. But the first reason would be you put a small array in and knowing that later on down the road, you're going to be putting a second one in. So because, because Victron MPPTs can be stacked next to each other, put the right one in. If you have four panels, if you have five panels, size it, build it, put that together. And then when you add your larger panels, you can do the other. The other thing that would be a reason is I could see on some very long RVs where you're just going to put a one row of solar panels on the right side and one on the left side. You can actually run those independent strings on their own charge controller. And then what happens is because if you have four or five panels and it isn't a string, so it's the positive of one going into the negative of the other, and you're just increasing the voltage. Now all of a sudden you have the sun coming in from the side and it hits the AC or it hits a roof vent and you have a fantastic vent cover over it or something that creates a shadow and it's hitting the panels on the shadowed side, it's going to affect that string's performance. So by separating them and doing it with some kind of mindset involved, you really can get more power output um, in less than ideal situations.